Yo, 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 it's time for the stream. What time is it? Yeah, yeah, it's the where we go online and we play video games. What time is it? Yeah, that's, that's, woo, we're doing it. I, uh, I don't know what, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm playing Getting Over It. I, I just got another playthrough done. I have done no pre-planning. Uh, I don't even have hentai music up. None at all. So the absolute first moment that anybody gets in the chat and says some words at me, uh, congratulations. You get to choose the hentai music. Congratulations, Fafurvtma. You get to choose the hentai music. Katamari Bob, I'm sorry, but you don't get to choose the hentai music. Okay, so Fafurvtma, I need you to just t say the name of a video game. Or maybe an anime. Uh, the the rules are they they have to be something that I've played because I, I, if if it's not something that I've played, it'd be spoilers. And two, you know, just good 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 music in general. You know, just good music in general. And also, you uh, you're on a very strict time limit. If you don't say something within like the next minute, I'm just gonna choose something on my own. So there you go. Big responsibility there, Swerve Tama. If you if you let me down, wow, are we gonna? No pressure, don't worry about it. Nope. Not once since I've ever done this has anybody ever said good hentai music. Not a single time. Okay, actually, I think maybe once or twice, maybe? But uh, the point is, don't, no pressure. Just say something and um, give this to at Katamari. But <laughs> okay. Svervitima has used the uh, call a friend button. <laughs> Katamari Bob, your friend Severftima is p is uh, politely asking for you to choose the hentai music for the night, Katamari Bob. It's it's all on you, Katamari. <laughs> all the all the pressure has been transferred. <laughs> ah. So Katamari, are we going to listen to good music tonight or are you going to are you going to let us down? <laughs> Sonic spin bo Oh no! Severtima, you did that on purpose. You passed it to Katamari because you knew that Katamari was gonna do some Sonic spin ball. Okay, here we go. We are doing Sonic spin ball OST. Now wait a second. Hmm. I wonder if we could. Uh... Wait, I haven't beaten Sonic spin ball yet. That would be terrible. You're. I, I haven't beaten Sonic spin ball yet. That would spoil it. Dang it. No, that doesn't fit my rules. But. Whatever. Okay, now, uh... Here we go. <laughs> so I'm gonna cheat a little. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, you said Sonic Spinball. You, uh... You never specified which Sonic Spinball. Also, that was probably way too loud. Half the soundtrack is like five second clips. Okay, uh, what was I gonna play? Getting, get over it. Let's do this. I don't have any console besides a broken PS Vita. I don't know a lot of games, so... Oh god, I'm sorry, Svervtima. You know, you can... You should probably get one? I mean, I, that is interesting. Do you... So, Severtima, do you, are you just, like, not, like, a, a hardcore gamer? Or do you game on PC? Or, or like... Because I find that really interesting, because you're on... You're on Twitch. You're on a video... <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this, but Twitch is primarily a video game website. You, you, you have entered video game land. Yeah. Uh, I beat Ratchet and Clank, right? That was t Oh, I beat Ratchet and Clank. I mean, not y you beat Ratchet and Clank, referring to me. And uh, yes, actually, I have uh, beaten Ratchet and Clank. So I could, I could do that OST, technically, possibly. But little late, little late, Katamari. You already said the Sonic spins. We're we're going with Sonic spins. Oh dang it! I'm trying to speed run. It's not working.
<laughs> nice! That was a close one. Ooh, nice! There we go. Haha! <laughs> oh yeah! This is happening! Hmm. It's definitely happening. That reminds me, uh, we have some really good news. I was kind of hoping there'd be more people here, but I mean, it's past midnight. What do you expect? Uh... I have ordered, uh, like a few months ago, I ordered a GameCube HDMI uh, adapter, and I've been waiting patiently for that for them to go into production for that. <laughs> they went into production. My GameCube HDMI adapter, not only does it exist, it is in the mail. My GameCube HDMI adapter is in the mail. It has been mailed from China and is going directly to me. So yeah, that's happening. Really soon, I am gonna get the GameCube to HDMI adapter, and that is gonna open up some doors on videos that I've been wanting to do for a little while. And it's basically going to mean that I'm not limited on uh, the videos, like, oh wait, there's another thing I need, and then I won't be limited on the videos I can do, like, much at all. I'll have, like, capture for basically everything. I mean, technically right now, uh, the reason I'm excited for GameCube HDMI is that, uh... I was... There we go. Uh, I was gonna do Game Boy games. Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and GBA games. But, uh... And turns out GameCube HDMI is like... Either GameCube HDMI or GameCube component is like the best way to get footage of Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and Game Boy Advance games. Uh, as long as you have a homebrewed GameCube. Which I do have homebrew on my GameCube now, so I can. Uh, basically there's like this little homebrew software called, uh, Game Boy Interface. It's basically just, uh... It is the Game Boy Player software updated to be, uh, more... More good software accurate, and with a lot of options. And yeah, so I'm gonna be able to do that, and I have Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster Capsule GB- Oh wait, spoilers. Spoilers for the video that's launching tomorrow morning. By the way, there's a video launching tomorrow morning, I'm excited for that. It is a video that I really care about, so I'm really hoping it does well. I'm kind- I'm kind of afraid it's just not going to. It's gonna be a video that nobody cares about, but it is one I care about so much. Also, morning, Jack-Jack. Oh, dang it. There we go. The only games I have legally are Overwatch, Batman 2, Lego for Vita, and Minecraft, so I tried to get addicted to games I don't have. That's why I'm on Twitch. I cracked getting over it, and that's basically all I play right now. Oh, don't do that. Oh. Oh, that makes me sad. Uh, yeah! Cool. Okay! We're safe. Uh, not for long, though. Okay, safe. It's a stupid hand. Cool. Okay, we're, we're pretty mostly safe now. Once we get on the hand. By tomorrow, do you mean the 5th or the 6th? Because it's past 12. I, I mean to the morning. And when the sun comes up, that is when my video is launching. The sun going up in the sky, that's the thing where it's going to be like the video happens. Okay, does that answer the question? <laughs> morning, Delta. Mm. But yeah, I'm really excited, though, once GameCube HDMI gets here, because uh, I'm going to be able to play... You know, I'm just going to spoil it for you. Monster Capsule Game Boy, which I've already played a bit of. And it's already looking really cool. Uh, the, the story is something I didn't expect, and it's something really cool that it's kind of surprising they never did anything with it in the main uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! series. Like, it's something that, that feels like that could be a, it could be a plot thing that happened. Uh, 
M minor spoilers. Uh, I, I The only reason I'm mentioning it is because if you've watched the Yu-Gi-Oh! anime, you already know this. It happens in episode one of the Duel Monsters anime. Uh, so, but, but still, spoiler warning. So there's the, there's the part where uh, uh, at the end of the Death T arc, Kaiba gets his gets his soul shattered by Yugi, right? And he has to pick up. I don't think they. I'm not. Okay, they didn't really explain it much in the anime, but in the manga, it's explained that uh, he's picking up his soul. Uh, he's picking up the pieces of his soul and putting them back together like a jigsaw puzzle, uh, in the hopes that it gets rid of the evil in his heart or something. Ah. Uh, so yeah, but so it basically it puts Kaiba in a coma. So Kaiba's, you know, just just he's he's just he's just a a body like with a with just a blank face on him. Uh so the story of Monster Capsule Game Boy is really neat. So this takes place after the Death T arc but before the Duelist Kingdom arc. So, uh, what happens, they haven't explained exactly how yet, it was only in the intro, uh... And I actually, I don't even know for sure, because I've only barely touched the game, but the implication seems to be that, somehow, the Millennium Ring, which is what is the, it's the Millennium Item that Bakura has, it found its way into, uh, into Kaiba's hands, while Kaiba was in the coma. And then... The spirit of the Millennium Ring, aka, I guess, I guess the English audience would call him Yami Bakura, you. But, uh, yeah, Bakura possesses Kaiba! So, the villain of the game is evil Bakura possessing Kaiba's, uh, like, soul-shattered body. And it's just such a, it's just such a neat thing that makes sense. Like, normally... All that happens is Kaiba's in his coma for a while, and then he wakes up, uh, like, at the beginning of Duelist Kingdom. Like, completely on his own. But now they're, they're, they're doing a little tie-in here. Or, you know, a little interqual. So yeah, they didn't say it outright in the intro, but the implication is, uh, yeah, the villain is actually Bakura. And that also explains, I was wondering about it, why is Kaiba the villain here and we're having a tabletop RPG thing? Because it looks like the boss battles in Monster Capsule Game Boy are like tabletop RPG inspired. Which, if you know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh, tabletop RPGs aren't Kaiba's thing. That's Bakura's thing. Going to watch in 160p in the hopes it won't buffer. Oh, I'm sorry, Delta. Yeah, I I'm, I'm just really excited to play that game, and once this game can get to HDMI gets here, I'm booting that up. But first, I'm going to have to do uh, Super Mario Sunshine. Because, uh, actually, it was for uh, for Christmas. Uh, Becca bought me Super Mario Sunshine. And I haven't played it yet because I was waiting for GameCube HDMI. And I actually only just realized a little bit ago... Couldn't I just play on the... I could probably just hook up my Wii and use the component cables on that, and that would be, you know... Basically the same quality. I'm stupid. I could actually go do that right now. Hmm. Oh, well, it's not a big deal. GameCube HDMI is already on its way. Come on! Oh, that works. Oh, dang it! Come on! No! I swear I was about to get a friggin' per personal best if I got up there. Oh, come on! Yeah! Okay. Oh, by the way, the Sonic Sonic Spinball Game Gear OST just ended. That's it. That was my time limit. No! 
Ow! Oh, stupid antenna. Or satellite dish, same thing. Oh, oh, dang it. No! Oh, should have swung it. Okay. Also, morning, Jason. How's it going? How is it going, Jason? Nope, nope, nope. Oh, crap. I, I, I think if I hadn't uh, flubbed the ground a little there, I would be at the bottom of the mountain now. Nope. Okay. I got a chest tomorrow. <laughs> or a test tomorrow. Okay, make sure you stay up all night watching the stream instead of studying. Also, study for your test. I was joking just now. Please don't be irresponsible. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh no, is he doing the... Oof, sorry about that. Come on, it's not like I lost anything. Jeez, Bennett. Bennett always thinking I, I like... Don't know what it feels like to play a video game. Okay. Dang it. Come on, stop getting stuck. Wonder was that an intentional design choice the way that like it gets stuck on these dishes? So that's like supposed to be the final challenge on purpose. There we go, we done. Nice. Oh no! We're gonna be stuck here for a while. Ah, uh, okay, that's not too bad. Oh no, 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 whoops. Too hard. Ooh, cool. Okay, we done. Let's see what our time is. Oof, says Kat Katamari Bob Permaban. Permaban for saying oof. I hate that meme. Uh, okay, clear time was 13 minutes, 32 seconds, which actually my best time was around 13 minutes. So let's go ahead and... I'm going to look up CyberScore, see what my best time was. So I may have actually just set a new best time. Okay, my best time was... Oh, yep! That, that was, this was a new PB! My best time was uh, 13 minutes, 50 seconds, 0. .846. I'll just go ahead and... There. There, now you can actually see the, see the, see the time. Yeah. 1332, 210. 1332, 210. Yeah. Also, somebody submit your friggin' score to getting over it on CyberScore. I'm still the only one. How am I still the only one? That makes me so sad. Uh, oh well. Okay, that's it. Now I'm just gonna play some splats. <laughs> 